All right, guys, um, I left Shoppers and um, came to the Holiday Inn. I thought that's where it was at, but no, it's across the street at the uh, Sportsplex. So that's where we're gonna head. Not supposed to go this way, but yellow. Yeah, we're gonna go right across the street here. Shit, there is like no fucking, oh, I see one parking spot, nice. Gotta love driving a bike. I'll park a little bit closer towards there, kind of like what people were saying in the comments so that somebody doesn't come in here and just run over my bike. All right, well, we're going in that uh, that blue building over this way. Um, yeah, I can change when I get in there. I got my uh, <clears throat> my boots and stuff. I had to take off my boots and put on my shoes. <clears throat> I haven't been in here in a while. I used to work out here. This used to be the gym I went to when I lived here in Dartmouth. There's the new Metro Transit uh, bridge terminal. I think it's probably about a year old now. In fact, where uh, all these cars used to be and such, the buses used to come in and out of here. It was just a pain in the ass, so they built a terminal up that way. I think it's got like a coffee shop and stuff like that in there. So unlike my high school, uh, Vanessa's, uh, has a lot of black students She kind of they my mom and my sister kind of live in more of an urban area and when I went to high school there was probably about I don't know I say four or five black students So in this uh, this school there's gonna be a lot more I Don't know why I'm telling you that but I guess make small talk <laughs> All right, so they're in row 10. I actually got a seat pretty close up. Thank you. There's a swimming pool over here if you want to go check it out. There's the big uh, water slide. Pretty cool. All right, men's bathroom. Okay. Yeah. Have a good one. Room ten. Kaylee, Brenda, Tiffany, Duggan. I would like to ask John oh, Chisholm to present Kaylee okay, the John them. Chisholm Award. I see them. <laughs> Graduating with a French Immersion Certificate, and with high honors, 
and is a recipient of the St. Mary's University Renewable Entrance Scholarship for $2,000 a year. At this time, I'd like to call J.J. O'Reilly to present Leah with the Royal Canadian well, Legion LCG I did. Scholarship for $1,000. Don't ask. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> I would also like to call Mr. Bill Wiles to present hey, Leah with the recipient of the Royal Canadian yeah. Legion Nova Scotia right. Command and AI oh, that's my camera. insurance bursary for $500. It records video. Put your hat yeah. back on. Jeffrey. <laughs> She get uh, her thing yet? And yeah. Leah is the recipient of the International French Language Delft Diploma Level B2. No, it is my helmet, but it's a camera that's attached to it. <laughs> All right, we're going down towards the stage because Vanessa's about to get her high school diploma. So, going down here. Evan Lori Higgins. Evan is graduating with honors. You didn't get her flowers? I can't, I, I can't believe I didn't get her flowers. Oh, uh, you fucked up. I should have. should have told me. I would have picked some up. You get a fifty thousand dollar scholarship, <laughs> sweetie. Sweetie, come here, sweetie. Oh, sorry. Give me a hug. Love you. Proud of you. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, just left the graduation ceremony. I don't know if the lighting was good enough in there or not. It was really dark. Uh, so yeah, my sister, she graduated high school. I'm really proud of her. Uh, I wasn't gonna stay in there for the rest of the graduation as there was still, there was like 250 graduates and she was like 100. So I wasn't sitting around for another 150. Plus uh, dad was getting ready to go. He has to get to work. Um, they're not going out for dinner or anything. So I think I'm just gonna take her out, maybe shopping or do something nice for her this weekend or tomorrow or Monday, one of the two. But anyway, guys, uh, I guess what I'll do is uh, shut off the camera now and then uh, figure out what it. Yeah! <laughs> and then uh, and then we'll figure out what we're gonna do for us today. So I'll see you guys. Uh, see you guys in a bit. All right, guys. We're just leaving the. Uh, the graduation ceremony. 
thought I'd turn on the camera to give you guys a uh, point of view of the McDonald Bridge. The uh, one we came over was the McKay Bridge. Sticking in a neutral for now. Got to get out this uh, change here for the bridge. Now I'm gonna pull this one off. <laughs> we'll try and figure it out. Holding money in one hand, trying to use the clutch in the same hand. Gonna have to one finger it. <laughs> Woo. Harder than it looks. Probably not the safest way of doing things. So I'm just gonna shut it down. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Um, this bridge here, you know, it's kind of sad to say, but a lot of people commit suicide on this bridge. So they put a lot of these uh, bars up here. So they have to climb it and it gives people time to stop them. This is, uh, that's downtown Halifax down that way. Definitely gonna go and visit that place at some point. Um, I might be going biking with a couple of friends this afternoon so we might actually head down that way if that's the case I'll definitely videotape it but this is the uh, McDonald Bridge it's starting to get a little bit nicer outside it's nowhere as near as windy as it was uh, as I was coming over the Halifax Harbor it's where all the shit and piss goes. Pretty nasty water in there. Yeah, the bridge we came over is way down there in the distance. I don't know if you can see it or not. really nice this afternoon it's uh, quarter to 11 now so hopefully it'll get nice by 1 p.m. oh fucking time is right on my uh, right on my bike I didn't even notice that <laughs> time is right there <laughs> 295 kilometers we put on this bad boy so far.
Definitely gonna hit the gym later on. Some nice condos above that cafe. Gus's Pub, they do um, open mic night there. Can be pretty funny sometimes. I'm also going to um, do some vlogging on my car as well, because I got the suction cup for the car. So I'll be able to put that on the front end or the back end or even on the inside dash. Kayla and I are gonna take a little road trip to, uh, to Moncton, which is about a three hour drive from here this summer. So we'll definitely take a camera with us. And of course, I have my, uh, my bachelor party in August. I'll be taking my GoPro for sure to Vegas, for sure. You guys are gonna get some awesome vlogs from that. And uh, Coltrane, you guys know who Coltrane is, some of you, from my stream. We did a rap battle against each other. He's actually flying in uh, to visit me uh, at the end of July, so the last weekend of July. And then I'm doing a big uh, fan meet uh, here at a big paintball place. I'll take my GoPro there too. We're gonna have a big paintball game with people all around locally. If you're from the uh, Nova Scotia area and you're interested, um, early July, I wouldn't say early, but I would say like second week of July, um, I'll have an announcement up, not only on Facebook, but probably on YouTube as well. And it'll let you guys know the date and time and what you can show up. I'm gonna try and uh, do set it up a little bit early so I can know how many people are coming and see if I can get some sort of deal for us. It almost looks like it's gonna fucking rain. I like Jeeps. So we are um, getting closer in towards my uh, my area. So I think what I'm gonna do, guys, I'm gonna go home right now and uh, start editing up this video. And then uh, I gotta get in the shower and scrub my head a little bit more because I have pink dye around my ears and stuff. So I'm gonna do that. And then uh, I'm gonna head out to the gym and probably do some more vlogging. <laughs> 